So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a Namecheap registered domain hosted on Bluehost. So you you have a domain which you registered on Namecheap. This is the the Namecheap dashboard, and uh, you want it uh, to be hosted on your Bluehost account. So what are the steps you you need to take? First, uh, let's see domain list on your Namecheap account and and find the domain you want to be hosted on Bluehost. This is the first one for me. So this is my my name, bolashsilagyi.com and uh, simply click on manage. It's pretty easy, by the way, so you don't really have to <coughs> worry about. You have to do some steps here on Namecheap and then you have to do some tweaks on your Bluehost account or to set up the hosting itself. <clears throat> so here you see name servers in in the Namecheap uh, manage tab and select custom DNS and what you need to put here is ns1.bluehost.com and ns2.bluehost.com these are always the same so ns1.bluehost.com and ns2.bluehost.com Click OK, save. It says please allow our system 83 seconds. OK, so the the countdown hits zero soon. And yeah, it's fine. Then go to your Bluehost account, select domains here, then select assign. This is what you need. You need to assign a new domain to your to your account. Okay, so here we are, and you you type your your domain name here. Here, this is balashsilagy.com. What we need, I just copy and paste it. You type it here, and if everything is set up correctly at the Namecheap site, it it's gonna say okay, ownership verified. So this is what you need. You see, uh, Bluehost already sees that you you have set up the the name servers on on the Namecheap site. And um, you need an add-on domain if you if you want to use your domain, of course. You need an add-on domain, and uh, I think this is fine to create a new directory just with the with the domain name itself. So you don't really uh, need to worry about this, and you just click assign this domain, and this takes somewhere between like thirty minutes, thirty seconds, and two minutes. It depends on your on your server. So Bluehost takes care of everything. They just create this add-on domain for you, and we come back when it's ready. And now everything is ready. You can see the the newly assigned domain here between your domains, and uh, it should work. Of course, there is nothing on this domain, but if I type it here, then. Uh, I see the Bluehost icon. So this means that everything is working fine because the domain is registered with Namecheap, but now it's hosted on Bluehost. So it's time to like use your WordPress or, or your website, whatever you want to uh, put here. But this is these are the only steps you need to host a Namecheap registered domain on your Bluehost account. So good luck with it. Hit the like button if you found anything useful in this video and please make the subscribe and thank you for watching.